Hey guys, we're here for Rebellious Noise at the Breakout Festival. We're here with Silent Screams. All right. How are you guys doing? Uh, good. Not bad. How are you? Uh, I'm, I'm really good. I'm really I'm excited for today. That's um, good. Can you tell the guys at home who you are and what you do in the band? Yeah, I'm Tom. Um, I do the clean singing and play a bit of bass. Uh, I'm Joel, and I uh, just shout into the... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. So I understand you guys are from Coventry, right? Yeah, man. So what was the scene like are. growing up in Coventry? wasn't wasn't the greatest. There was obviously always like local shows and stuff. Um, there was a place called the Jailhouse where every band in Coventry used to play. It was all right. You know, it's just it's not really obviously like the best city out there. Like right. if you live in Cov, you generally go to Birmingham because it's okay. like a bigger, better city. There's more things going on. So. Yeah, and no, I mean, yeah. Is that what you guys did then, just went to Birmingham? I was from Manchester, so... You're from Manchester. How yeah. did you guys hook up then? Um, well, I support... When I was in my old bands, I supported Silent Screams, so okay. and I was, like, a massive fan of these guys, cool. so I was, like, fucking, like, ch chilling out and talking right, to them all yeah. night, and then we just kind of kept in contact that way. Cool. And then when James eventually stepped down, they got me in. Right, right. So yeah. what was it like in... Uh, did you do shows in Birmingham at first then, or...? Well, no, I mean, I've... I'm not one of the original members. I've been in the band for maybe like coming on to four years now. So right. when I joined, the guys had already sort of like established a, a sort of touring base. And yeah. when I joined, we went to Europe. Uh, and okay. then shortly after that, we went to Joey Sturgis to do the album and then went to Australia, et cetera, et cetera. But yeah, like before that, the guys would have started gigging in Coventry and then got around, you know, just wherever they could in the UK, just like everyone yeah, else yeah. does. So Cool, cool. Yeah. I mean, I recently saw you guys uh, hit a milestone on Facebook. Uh, as far as likes, uh, yeah. I just I, I'm just wondering. I had, a, I had a conversation with one of my friends recently. How um, it's kind of like the modern day way to scale your band success. As far yeah. as uh, like back in the day, it would have been uh, record sales. You know, like yeah. me and my friends, we used to say like uh, like certain local bands would judge them by that. We'd be like, oh, if you got this many thousands, that's kind of like going platinum. You know what I mean? Yeah. So like YouTube hits yeah. and stuff like that, because it's, yeah. it's a different kind of ball game nowadays. You know, I'd say like YouTube hits definitely. I mean. Things like Facebook and that can can differ. Can you know, vary, like, yeah, yeah. Th there's ways that you can you can bump your Facebook likes up, and we we never bought likes, but you can do things where you can put advertisements up. So yeah, yeah. it comes down so in the side bit, so people can check you out, and if they want, then they can like. So I think I think we did that maybe for like a month at, at one point, but yeah, it's I don't know, it's just seem just seem to go. But the the downfall of Facebook now, obviously, is that you can put out a status. But it'll only go to like ten yeah, percent no unless you pay and all that kind of yeah, stuff. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Which you know, when it's like a big announcement, sometimes we'll do it's that. Difficult. But again, it, you're still not reaching the potential. Right, so yeah. those like a hundred thousand plus likes in the end don't actually mean anything. It's just like you say. It's just you see the figure, yeah. and you're like, oh, cool. This band must be big, so yeah, I right, guess I'll yeah, follow yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. Which yeah. Um, Kind so of, what's your what's your plans for the next kind of year then? You got anything going on? Yeah, we're going um, to tour. I'd yeah. imagine you got something. Going. Uh, well, yeah, because we released the new album, Hope for Now, uh, a few months back. Cool. Um, we just need to tour the ass off it. Yeah. You know, we need to. Just, How's it going so far? Well, we'll start our first tour since releasing it. We were on the Attila tour, and yeah. that got postponed till next oh, year. I saw that, yeah. So then we picked up and we've got on the Crossfade tour. Oh, which is going to be really yeah. insane! It's some massive, massive venues, so it's yeah, going to be cool yeah. to be playing new stuff off the new album in like places we've never been before, right, places yeah. we've never, you know, venues we've never played before. How do you guys feel about being like a, a support for a band? I mean, obviously it's a great opportunity, but uh, I'm sure you go to shows growing up yourselves uh, and know what it's like from the fans' perspective, seeing guys come on and be like, "Who are these guys?" Yeah. How do you feel people usually uh, receive receive your bands? At the end of the day, man, it's like, you know, we could carry on touring, we're doing like a headline show, yeah. a headline tour, like every other month, get the same amount of kids coming. At the end of the day, you need to be need to grow, playing yeah. to people that don't know yeah, who you yeah, are. Definitely. So at the end of the day, if we're going and playing like on the Crossfade tour, like the Coco in London, a thousand cap, yeah. and the, there's 900 kids there who don't know who we are, yeah, that yeah. for us is a plus because yeah. it get, gives us a chance to, 
you know, hopefully convert those guys and turn them into silent screams. Better than paying. Don't think we blow anyway. Yeah. <laughs> as well, long as 900 yeah, kids yeah, yeah, do, yeah. do whatever. Better than paying for Facebook likes anyway. Yeah, you know? exactly. Like, it's, it's you, know, it's like, it, yeah. you pay for Facebook likes and it's like, sweet, you've got yeah. 20,000 likes. And now, nobody actually And care, there's going to be yeah. seven people that's going to show up to And that's yeah. the thing, like, things will always fluctuate and change. Like you say, it's completely different to how you judge a band now. You judge them like how they appear online, etc. Yeah. But at the end of the day, touring will always be the thing that matters the most. Yeah, that's like the Chelsea. Exactly. Grin tour we did back in March. That yeah. did really We've had well. Constant for us. people saying, "Come back, come back, come yeah, back." Yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. From those cities, people that you wouldn't to, have reached, didn't know through, who yeah. they were when we were there, and we would we would play and go to the merch. Heaps of kids coming up, never seen you before, mm. never heard of us. Wicked buy a shirt, and that's what it's yeah, all about. It was, really. it Chelsea Grin wasn't, yeah, you know, technically the type of band we would have thought we would have got paired with. Right. You know, they're super heavy. Yeah, yeah. We've got singing in and stuff like that, and yeah, a yeah. lot of tours don't really connect that way sometimes. But I mean, it did really well Managed for us. To fit. Yeah, 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 really cool. It so, can be hard though. I mean, like you know, some shows you just get because they don't know your songs, right? And it's a bit different. They don't really know how to react, so they will just stand and watch. So yeah, yeah. a lot of the time, you have got to just. Put yourself out it doesn't mean people don't like it though, because a lot no, of people exactly, are like yeah. so well, it. It can I'm, be I'm quite daunting if you're, f you know, a full room and you know kids. Are yeah, you're like, oh, what does it mean? mean? You're yeah, really yeah, on yeah, yeah. But like you say, it does. They are paying attention. Yeah, the amount of times I've gone to shows and I'm like. This band is so good, but I haven't got the right kind of guys yeah. around me. I haven't, you know, I'm not hyped tough enough, yeah. and I'm like, I'm just gonna stand here. But these guys are good, and I'm gonna tell yeah, them on yeah. Facebook. But right now, I'm just gonna sit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so, yeah, you, yeah, yeah. Mean, every band gets a great deal of that. Yeah. We had a few shows, you know, when we were in Europe and stuff like that, and we've kind of played, and I've come off thinking like, oh, man, what was that? Like, yeah, yeah like, what was that? that? And then you get to the merch table, and there's kids come over saying like, you are awesome, and it's like. Really? Yeah, you just looked like you hated yeah, me yeah, for yeah, the past yeah. 40 minutes. It looked like you thought I sucked. <laughs> so. Um, so, like, thinking ahead, um, I don't, I don't want to go for the usual, uh, what's your goals in five years type stuff. I don't want to hear about festivals, and I don't want to hear about uh, record sales. I want to hear about weird stuff the bands end up doing, you know? So, like, uh, uh, like we've mentioned before, uh, some bands got video games, some bands, their music are in video games. Like, Ben Serenfold just made a game for themselves. Um, mm. You've got, yeah, like, uh, you know the theme of a wrestling event you've got you know a sky sports advert what, what kind of stuff would you or like even making a clothing line what kind of thing would you guys like to do but not saying oh this is my ultimate goal but oh that'd be cool if, if we, could, we could what would we do yeah 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 have a tv sitcom but, well, about the band yeah like the live the same house and yeah. it'd be really wacky <laughs> I think opening a ski resort is in a ski yeah. resort. Yeah. Silent Silent ski resort. resort. Ski resort. I just yeah. play yeah. live whenever you want. Silent ski resort. Silent yeah. ski yeah. resort. <laughs> Sounds very good. Eight words. Everyone likes snow, so. I am um, <laughs> the biggest fan of snow. Oh, let down. Breaking okay. news, you know. Well, you can do your sitcom then, and I'll. I'll rake oh, it in with the ski resort. <laughs> I hope oh, this isn't a riff sign here, guys. Yeah. <laughs> you blew it. I'm out of uh, <laughs> Breaking news is out yeah. the back. Yeah, yeah. Um, all right, okay. So the final question is we'd like to ask everyone, if you wasn't in the band, you had to leave for something, um, hopefully you won't, but what would you, who would you pick uh, to take your place? Could be alive or dead, could be a legend, could be someone that's in your mate's band. Um, who, who would replace you and who would replace you? Shit. That's a tough question. I can replace you. I can't replace you. I cannot replace you, Thomas. I couldn't do it. You're covering ground after that That's last year. You say who you'd get to replace me, and I'll say who gets to replace you. Can't and you say go if you first? Because I literally have no fucking idea. Just choose yourself. Who's I'm just going to say something stupid like, like Jimi Hendrix. Yeah. There you go, Jimi Hendrix. That's what I mean. Because I can't think. I don't know. <laughs> I would get. Um, Let me think of someone who's dying. Michael Bolton. <laughs> I get Michael Bolton to replace me. Cool. And that shit I'd get Michael legit. Bolton to replace you too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'd fuck it. Let's just get Michael Bolton. All right, so we got Michael Bolton. Who else? <laughs> Ask him. Michael yeah, Bolton again. <laughs> on bow. Oh wow. There you go. So uh, double Bolton. He'll be doing double duty, double but double I'm Bolton. sure he can handle it. Yeah. So yeah. All right, cool man. He's got the experience. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he has. All right, cool. Well, it's been good chatting to you guys, man. Yeah, I hope man, you're you today, man. Thank Take you. care. Yeah. Pow. <laughs>